but that is also the reaction coming in from the Union Education Minister Dharmendra Pradhan, who has said that the report, which has been submitted to the UGC by Jadavpur University, where a student had died recently after allegedly being dragged and sexually harassed, was not satisfactory. In fact, the minister went on to say that the TMC government in West Bengal cannot skirt any responsibility for the incident. Besides this, in another development, the Jadapur University Dean of Science Faculty, Shubhinar Chakraborty, who headed the 10-member inquiry committee into a student's death, has also resigned from his post. Jadapur is a very prestigious education institution in the country. लेकिन इन दिनों में जो घटना सामने आई है ये बहुत चिंताजनक और दुखद घटना है मैंने यूजीसी को इन दिनों में सुझाव दिया था कि यूजीसी अपने अधिकार के तहत जो एक यूजीसी एक्ट है उस एक्ट के तहत एंटी रैगिंग जो व्यवस्थाएं होनी चाहिए जो सारे प्रोटोकॉल उनकी है सीसीटीवी कैमरा लगेगा अलग से सेल होगी निरंतर कम्युनिकेशन जारी रखा जाएगा फैकल्टी और अनुभवी फैकल्टी स्टूडेंट्स के साथ जुड़े रहेंगे फ्रेशर्स के लिए अलग पहल किया जाएगा कोई भी स्टूडेंट को अत्याचार करने का रैगिंग करने का किसी के अधिकार नहीं है Let me just go, go across to my colleague, Komalika from Kolkata. Uh, Komalika, first, what is it that the report that he's talking about, the minister is speaking about a report which is not satisfactory, what did that report actually mention? You know, just after the incident, UGC hmm. asked, to, asked for a report from the university authorities. And the university authorities provided a report to them, but the UGC is very much annoyed rather with that report because that report had no clarity. It was a very generic report. There were no details. There were no answers to various questions which has been raised by the UGC. And that's why UGC has sent a further mail to Jadavpur University stating that they should again file a report within seven days, which is next week. So the minister has referred to that report, which is absolutely not satisfactory. The role of the authorities are really in question. And in that aspect, this type of a very generic the report was very unacceptable. That's what we are getting from you. But you know, Kamalika, you also have got, get us this news that one of the deans of the science faculty has resigned and he was a member of the 10-member inquiry committee. Would Is this significant? And any idea what are the reasons why he is given for resigning? See, one thing is very clear that uh, mm. this committee, uh, the person who was heading the committee, they were also... Uh, you know, talk that the new VC who has come yesterday only who has been appointed by the Chancellor. This Dean was not very happy with that also. So that's what, you know, uh, you know that's what is the corridors of Jabhat University. So there were an internal political um, couple, which, internal political conflict between this professor and uh, the VC, the present VC. But apart from that, whatever uh, uh, investigation the Jadapi University is also doing that is not coming to any proper conclusion and we still, still don't see a very positive role from the authorities. They are pressurized and after that they have stated that they have started the checking. None in our the entire tenure of Jadapi University this checking was not there. This started and that too at the cost of a 17 years old boy. So, uh, mm. you know, there might be this reason also that we got very uh, disturbed with this thing that nothing is happening and also the VC reason is also there. But Kamalika, in case the second report fails to satisfy the UGC, what can really happen then? Now, that's a very good question, Pallavi. In there where, you know, there is a chance that this five-star university might lose accreditation from UGC. Okay. And you know, this, this is the strong stable uh, that the UGC can uh, take and what we are getting, the mail that has been sent by the UGC uh, to Jadapur University was very strict. Now mm. for that, Jadapur University has really woken up from their sleep and they are doing certain things. But implementation of CCTV camera will also be difficult for Jadapur University as that has to pass in the EC and student members, are, mm. students are there as the members of EC. So there are a lot of complexity. But yes. if UGC is not satisfied, then Jadapur may lose its accusation. That's a very serious point, uh, you know, that, that's a very serious thing which is coming up if things are not falling in place.
Hmm. Yeah, absolutely. And it's the students who may end up paying the price for this. But more than that, the fact is that now the attack is also coming in on the West Bengal government. Many thanks, Komlika, for getting us all those details.